Ted Bailey has suffered a major drop in support with the latest news poll showing less than half of Victorian voters are satisfied with his performance as Premier. The poor result comes amid growing concerns about jobs and the economy. State political reporter Andrew Lund. If Alan Goodger represents the average man on the street, Ted Bailey might have a problem. I'm a liberal voter, but he's not doing very much at the moment. The latest news poll appears to reflect that sentiment, with the Premier's satisfaction rating dropping 11 points from 52% in September-October last year to just 41% in January-February. They all keep saying, oh, we've heard that the previous government. That's a lot of crap. I mean, he's been in there on... 14 to 15 months now. Launching a revamped $10 million beach protection program designed to avoid a repeat of last year's sand replenishment debacle at Half Moon Bay, the Environment Minister played down the poor poll result. We don't comment on polls. Um, but, the, the fact of the matter is that the government's getting on with the job and, and uh, making sure that we, we're fixing the problems and making sure that we're, we're taking Victoria forward. Labor has managed to make up ground but still trails the coalition on a two-party preferred basis. Support for the Greens has dropped slightly but they're optimistic about their chances in the upcoming Nidri by-election. What that poll won't tell you is that 25% of the population are no longer wedded to any political party. Ted Bailey can take some heart from the poll. He's still a comfortable 32 points ahead of opposition leader Daniel Andrews as Victoria's preferred Premier. Andrew Lund, 9.